How to design a document revision history template. Keeping track of revisions you, you made to a frequently updated technical document or business document is very important. A document revision history table showing all the revisions by dates, etc. will save you a lot of headaches when it's time to send out your document for review. For one thing, uh, subject matter experts, SMEs, are very busy people. When you ask them to please review a document, the immediate question they will ask you is, what are the revisions? What are we uh, going to review? Because frankly, they have a point too, because some of the documents can go hundreds, even thousands of pages. And to expect them to read every document from cover to cover, especially if it's, uh, if it's an updated document, not brand new, might be a little bit too much to ask for. So you have to look at the revision and review cycle from their point of view as well. So uh, I would highly recommend you send your reviewers a revision history table or summary. And this is what I would like to recommend you to do. As you can see, Every row is dedicated to a specific uh, revision. First, uh, you have the document name, version, release, build number on the second column. Third column, you have revision date, when the revision was made. Then you have the description of the revision. For example, added a new section 4.1 about calibrating the lenses to chapter four system configuration. Then at the last column, if you have one, uh, you can add tracking notes with the ticket number so that the reviewer, if both of you have access to the same tracking system, uh, can just go and check out that number and read more uh, about the revision uh, in question. But if you are a lone writer, probably uh, that might not be necessary. So whether the end users should see such changes is a decision you should make after discussing the issue with your client or the product manager. And it really depends on the outcome of the review itself. Uh, sharing the review history with your reviewers is always a good idea and will bring you praise and earn you much goodwill within your company, since such a list makes life easier for all involved. So try to come up with your own version of revision history and make sure you send them to your reviewers and subject matter experts. So that's the tip of the day, and I see you in the next video.